If you want to make money with video, your video needs to be seen. And the fact is, when it comes to ranking videos, backlinks are still king. If you want to see your video on page one of Google and YouTube, you know that social shares and on-page SEO won't be enough, especially if the keyword is in any way competitive. Of course, you can spend hours to build link after link, or if you don't have the time, you've got to hand your credit card to a virtual assistant and tell them to go nuts. Seriously, it can cost you so much time and energy. Or you could use Video Bookmaker, an incredible push-button software that helps you rank your videos higher and faster. Video Bookmarker blasts out social bookmark backlinks like an Uzi on Overdrive, and I can say that it's some of the most up-to-date link-building software ever built. Here are just some of my favorite features of Video Bookmarker. Number one, as standard, you'll get 500 site database included. You'll also get the ability to add even more sites of your own. Number two, Video Bookmarker was coded by an expert, which means it's one of the most efficient tools on the market. You can even set how many resources you want devoted to a task. Number three, mass account creation. With this feature, you can set up thousands of bookmarking accounts at the push of a button. Number four, unlike some other backlink building tools, Video Bookmarker has nothing to hide. You get to see all the key details of the sites you're linking. Alexa rank, domain authority, and more. And a regular report on how many backlinks have been posted and are active. In short, Video Bookmarker will help you to rank any video on Google, get more traffic to your website, increase your commission in any niche, and of course, create backlinks faster than ever. The software has a lot of features and to help you getting started. My friend Peter Beatty will help you explain more about Video Bookmarker. Hey, how's it going? Peter Beatty here with a quick demo video for you for the new Video Bookmarker software. So before we get started, I want to take you over uh, to the settings tab here and just show you a few of the background features that make Video Bookmarker so powerful before we actually head into the account creation and the link building uh, tasks that the software can do. I think it's important for you to know, you know what actually is going on in the background and what makes Video Bookmarker so powerful uh, and successful at building links. Uh, so let's head over to the settings tab. And what I want to point out to you here uh, is a few things. The first things, uh, the first setting is where it says maximum number of threads per task. Now this basically means that that uh, Video Bookmarker is programmed in a way that it can run multiple tasks at once. It can do multiple different things at once. It can create accounts. It can create accounts on 15 different sites at the same time. It, you know, it can run, uh, it can create accounts while also building links. It's powerful, okay? So max threads per task basically means that this is the number of parallel processes going on at the same time. For example, if we had Video Bookmarker uh, creating accounts for us on you know, various uh, bookmarking sites, well, that means that if we set it to 10 or 15, if we set this to, let's say, 15, what that means is that the software is actually doing um, account creation for you on 15 different sites at the same time. Amazing stuff here. So instead of doing one at a time and then moving on to the next one, it's doing 15 at a time. Obviously, that gets things done quicker. Now, this one right here where it says maximum number of tasks to run at the same time, this basically means uh, if instead of just working on one task, like, um, you know, instead of just building links, and then, you know, after it's done building links, then going out and, you know, creating accounts. Basically, that means it will do those tasks at the same time. Now, timeout right here. This basically means that this is the time that the software actually waits before skipping the site. Okay. Now, some sites are faster and some are slower. And some take sites, uh, some sites take a long time to load because they have low bandwidth. So setting this to like 300 means it will wait five minutes before uh, it actually times out. So those are just a few of the key settings that I wanted to point out to you before we get started. So uh, the rest of these we'll cover in some more in-depth tutorials. So let's close this window here and we'll go ahead and start creating some accounts on the bookmarking sites with Video Bookmarker. So basically the way the software works is that we have these different tabs here, projects and 
tasks, okay? Uh, the first thing that you should do is you should create a project for your project. So let's just say that we're creating um, some backlinks for a video for a client. So we'd actually enter that name, that client name in here. So let's, so let's enter um, carpet cleaner client video. Carpet cleaning client video campaign. Okay, and we'll hit save. Now you can obviously name that whatever you want. That's totally up to you. Now we'll go ahead and add tasks. So let's say now we have a video for this client created. We want to get it ranked on the first page of Google. All right, what do we do? Well, we want to start building backlinks to this video. So the first thing that we do is we go over here and we click on account creation tasks. So what this means is that video bookmarker is going to go on all these sites, over 800 websites that are loaded in the software and start creating accounts for us so we can start posting our links, our backlinks automatically back to our video. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and click on account creation task. Now we're gonna enter a task name here. So let's call it uh, video campaign one. And we'll go ahead and select a profile. So I'm gonna go ahead and just select this one here just for demo purposes. And these are all the sites that the software is going to build uh, links on for us. So we're going to click here, click uh, select all sites, and we'll click save. Okay. So now what the software is actually doing is it's actually creating accounts on all these sites for us automatically. So we'll just go ahead and pause the video while the software does the work, and I'll be right back. So now we get this message here that sites have been added successfully. So we're going to click OK. Now, by the way, you saw a few minutes ago where I actually selected a test profile that I created. Well, if we go over to the profiles tab here, this is where you can actually create your profiles that the software will actually use to register these accounts for you on uh, on the bookmarking site. So you can always come back here and add different profiles. But basically, the software is going to be using these profiles for you to register on the sites. So let's go back to the projects tab. Now, let's go ahead, now that we have our accounts created, let's go ahead and start building some links. So we'll go to the bookmarking task here. Oops, we gotta turn off scheduling. So now we'll go back to bookmarking task. And let's go ahead and give the task a name. Let's just call it demo client task, okay? And click next. And again, we're going to be selecting one of our profiles that we set up. Again, this can be any profile that you that you know that you want to use. We'll just go ahead and use this one here. And now we're going to select all the sites that we want to start building our links on. Okay. Now, one important thing I want to note about this list: these are all the sites that come preloaded into the software. Okay. This list can be updated uh, regularly, or you can also add your own sites to it, you know, manually as well. It's totally up to you. But they come preloaded into the software. So let's go ahead and just select all of these sites here. I'm just going to scroll down, hold shift, and they're all selected. Okay, so let's hit next. Now, this is where we actually enter in our video that we want to start building links back to. So let's go over to YouTube and grab our video. So here's a video that I'd like to possibly rank right here. So we'll go ahead and grab the URL right up here. And we'll go back to the software. And we'll go ahead and enter the link of the video right there. Now we can always we can just use the same title from the video if we want to, or we can enter a custom title. You know, it's totally up to you. So we'll enter uh, title and we'll enter description. And we can give it some tags if we want to. It's just well, we can say video marketing or whatever we want here. So now we can go ahead and just add that. So now, if we go ahead and click save, the software is going to start building links back to this video here. Now, a few things I wanna point out before we go ahead and move on to the next step. And one is right here where it says, run now or submit um, so many sites per day. For example, if you wanted the software to uh, build links on maybe like five sites per day, then you would go here, you'd click submit and enter the number five here. This would obviously, you know, uh, make the process take a little bit longer and look more natural. Or you can also spread the submissions over a set number of days. Let's say you want to spread it over three days. Well, you can do that here. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and click run now. So the software will do it right now. Another thing we can do is we can actually crawl the site for any active links on the site. So if you want to grab some links from the link that you're actually building back to, you can actually do that here. So let's go ahead and just click save. 
Now the software is actually going out and building links back to our video here automatically for us. So there we go. It's done just like that. So let's go ahead and click OK. And it's done. Now after we do that, we can actually check back on the status of our project by just going back to the tasks tab here. And you can see the percentage of the task that is completed. You can see that the software is still creating accounts and it's still building the links. So we can always check back here to check the status of our, you know, any task that we are running. You can see that on various different sites here, the software is still working on other tasks. Okay. So you can always come back here and check. Some other things you can do is you can always just check on uh, sites and see what the stats are. You can see, you know, what sites you're actually getting success on as far as registering new accounts and posting your links. So that's a quick demo video of Video Bookmarker. Overall, it's a really advanced link building tool. I mean, there's the stuff I've covered in this video, just scratching the surface of what this software is capable of and the different features that are within it. Again, we cover all this stuff in more detailed tutorials inside the members area, but this should give you a, you know, a quick idea of what, how the software works and how easy it is to use and how advanced it is. All right. Thanks for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.